Today on Batterbox.com, we're going to be talking to one of Nigerians' biggest, tightest, sexiest, mm. handsomest, mm. most talented mm. you know, <laughs> artist. Mm. And his name is Inyanya. Yes, sir. What up? It's Inyanya. What's happening? What's happening? Good morning. Having fun. Happy New Year. We should the same. Happy New Year. Happy 2014. What's going on? At least three times a week. Three times a week? Yeah. What do you do? I do a lot of press ups. Press ups. Yeah. How many? It depends on my mood or you know, the time I have. I could do like 200. Yeah, but that 200 is like four sets, so I do 50 four times. Wow. I mean, it's nothing, trust me. It's 200 just, is nothing. It's nothing, man. 50 press ups is nothing. It's just that, you know, I feel like. We don't really take it serious. If you take, if you love your body, then it'll be nothing. I know people that do one thousand, yeah, like make, ten times. They do hundred, ten times. I know people that do that. You're making people like me sound very dizzy. <laughs> like you do two hundred. Trust me, it's nothing, man. So you're doing a new movie, The Ransom with Eva Nelson. How do you? I don't understand that. I, I don't know anything about that. I'm not doing any movie with anybody. I, did I, have you seen a tweet or Instagram me saying I'm doing a movie? I'm no. not doing it. No, I'm not doing it. Okay, so you're saying all the Linda Cages and the Bella Ninjas and everybody. I've not even like read any of those things yet. Hmm. All right, so if you want to be a famous person hmm. for one week, who would you, who would you switch sides with? Donald Trump. Hmm. Why? Because dude has so much money, man. So much investments, Trump Towers and all that stuff. It's just amazing. And being famous comes with like the bad side of having relationships. Yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. And oh, you yeah. have experiences like that. It's, it's, it's possible. I'm in Yaya right now. And uh, if I'm dating you and we have issues, you go on Twitter and say, you just broke my heart or something. But if it was the normal guy, you just go to your room, sleep and hang out with your friends and get over it. But because I'm a yaya, you make you wanna make an issue out of it. You know. So Linda will put it up. Do you have a beef with Linda? Like personal beef? I don't have a beef with her. I think she's actually very, very beautiful. Hmm. First time I saw her, but I don't I don't that's bad that's bad side. But you know, it comes with the territory, man. When you're famous. You can't get away with too many things. No. If you're famous right now, and I'm dating you, and I take you to the club, and I drive and I leave you there, it's gonna be history. But if your boyfriend did it, you you get mad at him, and you still drive your way home. You find your way home, you know, it's just like that, man. About Davido's party. Mm. That you went to Davido's party, and because mm. you didn't have an invite, you were not allowed in. What happened? Let me first of all clarify something. Huh? For anybody to say that they bounced me from somewhere, you know what that means? Okay. It means I'm a boss. It means you're a boss. Yeah. Okay. Because if I'm not a boss, you won't notice that they bounced me. Sure. They bounced plenty of people that. But the thing is that I can't be bounced. I was with Davido at Deuces. Davido told me himself, hey G, I want to go change. I went there and Davido has like, his fans are very, very, they're passionate about Davido and they were all out there and they said they must go in the club and the club locked the gate because the guys wanted to go in anyhow and I was standing there and they wanted to go open the gate and I couldn't stand there no more, I had to leave. It was my decision to leave, not bounced. The club wanted to open the gate for me. But because I couldn't even pass, I couldn't even, the fans, I couldn't even walk to the entrance. I'm like, there's no point, man. David is my neighbor, he's just next door. We have a song that we just did last week. We never had a fight ever. So why would it, everybody just wants to say, ah, this boss, they bounced this boss. So thank you so much, guys, for recognizing. <laughs> How many of you are they bounced out there? Yeah. How many of you are they bounced and they put it on Linda? How many people are they bounced out there and they put it on Linda? Not many now, but mine, they put it up because they knew that I shouldn't be bounced. You know what I'm saying? They recognize that I work so hard. I'm a G right now. Why should they bounce in Yaya? He's a G. That's why they're making noise about it. So respect them, man. I'm in my zone right now and I see my house. I'm chilling. You understand? God has blessed me. So how are you going to say they bounce me? Bounce me where? 
2014, what should we expect from the international artists? Are we expecting collabs? Let's see how it goes. But I know one thing for sure. It's God's year. It's a big year. Hmm. My plan is to be successful this year by God's grace, not just musical. Hmm. Business, investments. I've, I've been able to, by, by God's grace, with the help of my manager, B. Franklin, with the help of my team, Triple MG, I've We've been able to build a brand for ourselves. We've been able to build a household name. So it's not just music right now. We want to reach out. We're working on talent hunts for, for the youths to give back to the mm. society. We're working on, we have an NGO to show love to the kids. Uh, I promise, I went to the prisons on my birthday last year. And I'm building a, we're building a studio for them this February. It's just so many things that, you know, I, we want to do. All right, your new song, Away, is mm. with a new dancer. Yeah. See, the thing is, I've been trying to learn it. It's very easy. It's the easiest. <laughs> so you teach me how to do it. Uh, yeah, man, if you want to. Are you ready? 